What is going on guys? My name is Drummer back in from Room Reviews here with a new series reaction to Darwin's game. This is going to be episode one, the first game. Now, this is actually something that's been on my watch list or something I've been looking forward to simply due to the fact that a fellow member, a fellow follower of mine was really adamant on me reading the, I believe it was a light novel. I know there is a manga of this somewhere um, or I might have gotten it mixed up and I was going to, but then I found out that this was going to be an anime adaptation, and I was going to go react to it in the in the meantime. Now, whether or not I'm going to continue reading uh, the light novel or the manga, I forgot. I don't know which one it is. Uh, after this, I don't know exactly. Just depends. I don't know a single thing about this, um, but judging from just sl small little thumbnails that people uh, that I've seen of the show. I'm guessing it's like this game, and if you guys don't know Darwinism, um, I kind of feel like there might be like some type of battle royale kind of thing to it, where it's like a game and your goal is to survive in the end of it, whether it be through uh, traps or dealing with other people playing this game. I don't know what this thing is about. Like I said, I'm going to this completely blind. I've done some audio settings, so hopefully you guys can at least hear the sounds of the show very slightly in the background, if you guys can hear it low enough. And I also fixed the actual the setting. Um, my logo is a lot bigger than normal, um, but that is only because of this wallpaper that I found. Um, usually, the when I find these kinds of wallpapers, the uh, character, this character where I here is usually a little bit bigger but it isn't so i may i'm trying to i increase the opacity level so it's a little bit harder to see the actual show i looked at it it should still be slightly visible for you guys for the most part um and i didn't see it when i was skimming through really quickly um i wasn't paying attention to this and i was just trying to look at the subtitles so you guys can see at least the bottom i didn't see any on the top yet and i didn't want to skip too much in case uh, skim too much in case i got spoiled to anything but like i said i only set up t i only saw um, brief like little frozen images uh, where there were some subtitles and I didn't even look at the subtitles I just wanted to make sure that you guys could at least see them in case there was like a double subtitles where there's two lines of subtitles and you guys can see them clearly because usually what I'll do is I'll set it up perfectly for the if there's one line but when there's two lines the top part usually gets a little like halfway cut off and I don't want that to happen um, I've also tested a little bit with the settings uh, like I said with the sound so hopefully you guys can hear it um, I don't know how it's going to sound like when it's compressed and put into YouTube if I can even put this up on YouTube and the first place if this is a notable company and they're very strict and they're really good with their uh, detection i might get this video taken down immediately who knows but usually i've been able to get away with it knocking on wood but yeah um i'm ready to jump into this episode like i said don't know anything about this um it is a simulcast and funimation has it so it's on a cruncher roll um, but I am curious to see just what all this is about. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, let's jump into the first episode of Darwin's Game Start in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Is that really how it starts? Oh yeah, because I went through the various... Alright. Is that like an invisible dude? Again, my my idea is that they're fighting for survival. Or trying to survive in general. Flip flop. I'm guessing is that the Alright, well you're still not pretty strong. Like five hundred thousand. Five points. So there's a support system. Okay. Don't know if that's like a teammate or a friend of his. No, just someone who's also in the game. Safety first. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
That's pretty cool, not gonna lie. Does he have a knife? No, he's just invisible. <laughs> Wait, what? No, you missed. Of course, it's a freaking guy in a ro ro rabbit mask. It looks like a rabbit mask. You're dead. In the neck. Yeah, you're dead. I mean, honestly, no, is that the... It's... No, that, I think that is an artery right here. Hold on. By the way, if your blood ever shoots like that, you have way too much pressure in your body and you would have already been dead a long time ago. And of course, it's number six, six, six. Oh, it's a panda mask. Okay. 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 Interesting premise. Still have no idea what the fuck it's about, but like I said, I'm assuming it's someone, it's a battle for survival. <laughs> yeah, that was only 38 grand. So are they in like a different space? Like, because the bodies, I mean, don't normally leave that. I'm guessing that's his friend right there. That was the one he called. But it's weird though, so why does the bodies leave indentations on the place they're, they let, lay it down? Okay, so my guess, it is a game. And if you survive, you get loads of money. Hence how they're able to get the bikes. And if you lose, you die. Uh... And everyone's like, yeah, don't do it. Don't do it. It's not worth it. A snake. Is that a, is that a, um, I'm so, like, I don't know if that was symbolism for, um, the snake and biblical, and biblical points. Okay, that's the chick, yeah. Isn't that the same chick in my thumbnail right here? Thing right there? Boom. Okay, so what's her weapon? Is it a freaking mace? No, you're not going to see what it is. Okay. Alright, so like I'm saying, I'm assuming... I'm assuming... That when you die, you are in a different plane of reality, in a sense. That's why when they're dead, they leave those imprintations that they were looking at. I saw that panda little uh, pen. Is that her? 
Whoa, what if she's the... Hold on, hold on. She's wearing a panda pen. She has a panda pen. Is that is that her? That is a panda pen, right? It looked like a panda pen. I'm guessing if that's a panda pen, that's her. That's I'm I'm automatically guessing that's the uh, one who just killed that guy in the beginning. He's gonna look at his neck. Yeah, no. Karaoke? No, me and karaoke don't mix. Me and singing don't mix. The only time you'll ever see me sing is by myself in my car. And even then I scare myself. Although I have sang at work and I did have a lot of uh, complaints that day, so. <laughs> Alright, so I, yeah, I am curious though. I'm s uh oh. Uh oh. No, it's not a panda pen. Okay, I, I was wrong. I was wrong. Okay, it looked like a panda pen for some reason. It really did. I mean, it was only for a split second when I when I was paying attention because I was looking at the form really quickly and then I saw it on the side. Okay, never mind. No, Johnny, don't do it. Yeah, I'm assuming it's it might be a, it might be a symbolism of the Bible. Uh, I if you think about it, six 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 number of the beast also ties into the devil. The devil is uh, the snake is also the animal representation of the devil. Symbolism. Oh, Banda Panda. Oh, so it's based off of, uh, it's based off of something. No, he's looking at the everyone else who happens to not be in that car. How are you, th how's that the first thing was like, hey, by the way, knife, hand, probably not a good combination. That, yeah, should have been point number one you brought out. He's not going to talk. He caught it with a, yep. Kick him in the balls. Okay, so, e okay, my guess, each of them has a unique power. That guy, the one in the beginning, had a power to split blades. Interesting. But he also, that band, Bonda, has the power to, um... That Bonda has a, um... The power to turn invisible. So, I mean... I am curious as to what his power is going to be then. <laughs> Are you on drugs? He's going to turn invisible. Oh, okay. Take his gun. I'm a snow, maybe. It's just a random checkpoint. Probably not going to be allowed to have a... Uh... Well, 
Wait. Wouldn't this be considered match interference? Because it was a one-on-one. -on -one. Okay, so they're called sigils. He has sure eyesight. Oh, heat. He can see heat. Oh, he got hit in the... Eh, he can live through that. It's a, it wasn't even that deep in there. <laughs> Pick up the... F See, if you had stabbed him in the ankle or the shin, it also would have surprised, um, slowed him down. <sighs> I'm assuming he's gonna uh, at least figure out what his, his sigil is soon. You know, you still have uh, something in your uh, thing right there. Although, granted, knowing that, um, it actually might be better to keep it in. You can actually lose blood from there if you took it out. The moment you're... Mm. Okay. Why don't you pay attention? He just said. <laughs> he's gonna look and he's, not, he's gonna disappear. He's not gonna be there. Oh! I lied. The tracking. There's a tracking. Huh. No, maybe it tracks the phone. The phone of the actual person, not... So, okay, I guess it only tracks the person who actually is part of the duel or battle, I guess. Shuka. I also have a feeling that Oh You can message other people, okay. It's always the cute ones that are the most uh It's always the cute ones that are the most demented. Oh, okay. He, he basically did a tourniquet on his uh, leg. I am curious, though. I'm pretty sure they're going to explain it, but I wonder how long this time limit is. So I actually thought it was going to end with... Um... Mm, okay. So, but like I was saying, I was assuming that there, this was going to end with them running the clock. But it seems that it's going to show this chick.
Hmm. It's because he's not part of the game. The other guy. I don't think it would actually work. It wouldn't matter if you were to kill the other guy. It's going to take me a little bit to get used to names as well, so. A flamethrower. Butterfly signifies death. Okay, so he is gonna die. It's gonna be the last stall. That's what I said. Does he have the knife, though? And also, it seems like if he's touching anything... Okay, it, dis it disappears if he can touch it. Okay, so that's what I was thinking. If you, if you hold on to whatever, if you're, whatever you're holding on to, it'll disappear with it. Double tap! Run him over again! <laughs> oh I was assuming uh, that it was the chick <sighs> time ends <laughs> so wh I wonder what happens when he loses <laughs> We're gonna see his face right before he disappears. We didn't get to see his face, you just got to see his eyes at the end. Oh, that's, a, that's, that's actually really interesting. Okay, so I was wrong about the whole different plane. At least when they died, they just pixelate. <laughs> As we get, he's gonna see the pixel line, pixelated line of his body. Weird. And he saw the butterfly in his uh, eye. You saw that. Good 
Good luck. Ah. Ten points. And how often are the matches? That's another thing. Is it just gonna pixelate? No, is it gonna get like a small delivery? It's a gun. Breda M9. Holy shit. I mean, that. I mean, this is what it looks like. And I wonder how often it is due. But like, sorry teacher, I gotta go. Uh, someone trying to kill me and I gotta kill him back. So uh, I'll be back. Give me like half an hour. <laughs> hmm. Christ. So Yakuza, but Oh. There's just so much going on. So her and him have been messaging back and forth. I mean, I'm assuming that was his avatar. Interesting. Don't be afraid, just come inside. Yeah. <laughs> Did you br bring the gun with you? You never know. Probably is.
And if you think about it, there was no official battle between them. Like I said, I'm assuming if you kill, if you kill another person while the fight a battle isn't happening, you don't get anything. It's her chain whip mace morning star thingamajig. I don't know. She's just flying around. And it's going to end here, huh? Oh! How long has this episode been going? It's been going on for a while. Looks going to be deceiving. One free question. Are you going to kill me? Again. It's anime, of course, again. <laughs> she has the nya. Okay. Or being a murderer. What happens if there's a draw as well? Like, let's say the two participants. I mean, don't. I, I'm just questioning this to myself. Um, if like the two members or the two people who get randomly selected have to fight each other and they don't inflict any damage, do they both get tied or do they both lose? It's true, he doesn't he doesn't even know what his sigil is. Fair assessment. Should. Until then. Oh, does that actually say? Sigil, sigil, sigil. What's it say? What's it say? Oh, so what's hers? Oh, he brought the gun! Oh, okay. Did he bring a knife? Oh no, what did he bring? Oh 
Uh, I'd kill you on the spot. Oh, shit. Blinded her and then ran away. <laughs> How long is this episode? Is this episode longer than the other ones? I'm just assuming because I've been recording for about almost 40 minutes now. Her eyes are closed. Why is her eyes closed? Oh, it's she's still? Oh, I just realized, by the way, I know I, I, I questioned this about how long was the um, match. It was an hour. So what's his sigil? His sigil is going to be had to be introduced at the end of this. I'm assuming his sigils. A baton. Yeah. So I'm like, her sigil, she can control objects. Like almost like a telep telepathic kind of thing. Or telekinesis. I don't know what they call it. Tell us something. Telescope. Let's go with that. <laughs> no. But. This is specifically that chain, though. That's what I'm wondering. What if it's a deflection? N no, I don't think so. Oh, man. All right. Let me see the sigil. Wait, wait, wait. Is this sigil like a split personality? No, hold on. Because I'm, I'm getting like a... Hold on. I, th I I was assuming. Hold on. I don't know. Again, I'm just I'm just. Com Wait. Okay. Wait. What? He can create weapons. He can create weapons whenever he wants. Are you at? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Cause that's right. Cause that nurse lady said, "When did I get two? So he has to be manifesting it. He's not bringing it from somewhere else. He's making one right on the right off of it."
And can you actually call off a match? I'm I'm enjoying this first episode, not gonna lie. This is a longer first episode. I think it's like a forty minute episode or something like that. Tourniquet. Smart. She's also like you can tell she like she's like, oh wait a second, wait a second. I think it's making anything up here. Because, like I said, it's the, um... But can he manifest anything? Or maybe if it's an inanimate object. He wanted a weapon. That's a strong... So uh, well, I mean... <sighs> Didn't need confidence to breathe? What's he gonna bring up? If he can create anything... Hold on. This is clean, by the way. The stun gun. Yeah, he would have suffered way more if you think about it. <laughs> of course, of course, you had to have some type of like romance love thing in there. Wait. <laughs> so if you give up, you had to kind of live as a, uh, almost like a puppet to the... But you basically had to live almost like a slave or a puppet to them?
Okay. You know, I'm legitimately interested in this. Oh, I know that voice. I know that voice. Apportation. <laughs> is she a waifu? <laughs> Depends. How old is she? <laughs> oh, my bow? Looks like a mobo. Oh, my bow. Is it Sancho? Holy, how long is this episode? Holy crap. Oh, God. So <laughs> I'm not ready for this. It's our house. Of course. Hey, it's like... Why are you naked? I have several questions. I'm guessing this is the intro. In which case, I'm going to have to mute my audio on here. I'm, I'm assuming this is the intro. So surrounded by three girls. Two of them look like lollies. Oh, she's a sniper. I have a feel I'm really gonna like this, guys. I have a feel I'm really gonna like this show. Okay. Holy shit. This was a, what? This was a 40 some odd minute episode. Are, are, are all of them going to be like this or just the intro episode? But yeah, this was about a 40. Hold on. Let's see how, what are we? What's it? Oh, it doesn't freaking say. Hold on. Uh, something. This is like jumbled up right here. You can't really see it. Um, it's about a 45 minute. It's a 45 minute episode. Holy shit. All right, so it doesn't look like there's anything at the end. Oh, wait, maybe. I just want to see if there's something. No, it's just going to end. Oh. Gemstone mine. Okay. That was impressive. Although a little bit too ham-fisted on the romance for because I've seen I've seen that stuff way too many times for me personally. That whole romance thing is like, oh, he beat me. I want his dick. I mean, I've seen that happen way too many times in anime. Um, so I'm a little bit numb to it. It's more of like, it's more of like a, uh, I've seen this happen before. I mean, I'm not too mad at it. It's just something I've seen quite often. But overall, this looks really interesting. I, th I don't, I don't remember who the guy was who recommended me watch this. I don't know if it was Mad Matt Forty Four. Don't know if it was you, buddy, um, or if it was someone else. Um, but I'm actually kind of glad I didn't go into this because I was really 
interested in the whole I like I didn't even look up the synopsis. I didn't look up a single thing. I just took what I thought of the term Darwin's game and then just from like two three screenshots that I had seen of the anime and that I had seen in thumbnails. Um so yeah, from what I can tell we're I mean we're I'm assuming that this guy is going to have to get to the point the main character is going to have to get to a point where he has to fight back and actually fight back. Um but I'm curious, like, what the limitations for his power is, if there even is any. If there's no limitations, that's some bullshit. Like, I'm going to create another person. Imagine that. But we'll definitely see. I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be um, limited to inanimate objects. And th I'm, there's a bunch of things you can do with that. Uh, so we'll see. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you guys think in the, in the comment section below. This was a really interesting show, and I want to see more of it. Um, it does come out Friday, so that does put a little bit of a damper on uh, my Flashback Friday series, um, which is not going to be is going to be returning next week. So look forward to that. Um, there is no Flashback Friday this week because I want to knock out the two episodes that I planned on doing um, and releasing them at the same time. Um, I'm not going to be able to get to the second episode for most likely today because um, I'm going to be doing stuff. In fact, this is probably going to be the last time you see my room like this. Maybe we'll see what happens because I'm going to be moving uh, my room around. Um, my desk right here, of course, is going to be over there, um, right next to my min window and which is going to be a lot better, um, because natural lighting is so much more nice to look at. Um, so yeah, but anyways, guys, uh, that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. I'd love to guys uh, hear you guys' opinions on just anything. Uh, and yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this and I will see you guys next time. See ya.